Liberals are cringing after California Congresswoman Maxine Waters made a senile threat to President Donald Trump's supporters. This really proves you can't fix stupid. Maxine Waters, D. California, has got to be the biggest embarrassment to the Democrat Party with a long history of cringeworthy gaffes in her past. The truth of the matter is that it's rare for many other Democrats to be caught spewing the level of imbecilic rhetoric that Waters does on a normal basis. This habitual idiocy is typically why Waters ends up in the headlines, and we are more than happy to share her latest outburst with you. According to Breitbart, Waters appeared on MSNBC's All In on Wednesday, May 30, 2018, with host Chris Hayes. During the interview, Hayes asked Waters about President Trump's impeachment. Her response ended in a senile rant and a threat to Trump supporters. I'm with the 70%. 70% of Democrats who have been polled say that they think that he should be impeached, Waters said. Waters tried to make heads or tails of the Democratic Party's strategy behind not emphasizing impeachment with the midterm elections upon us. That didn't go very well for the demon hag either. I understand the reticence of my colleagues and the Democratic leadership who say, don't feed the notion that is being presented by the Republicans that say that all they want to do is impeach the president because they're mad about the fact they lost the election, Waters said. I get that, and I understand why that would cause them to not want to talk about it. But, I just don't have those fears. At some point in time, we have to deal with reality. We have to deal with some truths. And, we have to deal with some facts, she continued. I know that people are saying we've got to wait and we've got to see what our special counsel will come up with. I get that. And, I believe that we need facts in order to move forward. But, the discussion must take place. We must not allow the President of the United States of America, who has this relationship with the country who hates us and who's undermined us and who's undermined our democracy, to not be talked about, to not be discussed, to not be talked about, the, 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 the reticence of our members to deal with it, Waters rambled. Then came the senile threat in the interview. I just will continue to talk about it. I think it is dangerous. I think that we should stand up for our country. This president has no respect for the Constitution. He's in bed with Vladimir Putin and the oligarchs of Russia and the Kremlin, and it's come out already. So, let the special counsel keep doing what he's doing in order to connect the dots for those people who say we need the positive proof, and I think we're going to get to the point where people are either going to have to stand up and resist this president and talk about he's dangerous for our democracy or they're going to go down with him," she exclaimed. This recent case of diarrhea of the mouth from Maxine Waters proves how utterly out of touch she is with reality. She is categorically wrong on every point and allegation that she made about President Donald Trump. How can the Democratic Party continue to allow this pathetic excuse for an American to represent their party? Maxine Waters jumps the shark at nearly every opportunity, and the end result is that no one takes her seriously. It's almost as if the voters in her district are playing a perpetually cruel joke on the rest of the country by continuing to send her back to Washington, D. C1 election after the next. The bottom line with Waters is that she represents the very worst of American politicians. There's nothing she won't say in her attempt to stay relevant to what is actually going on. As Maxine Waters continues to attack President Donald Trump and his supporters, it only solidifies the idea 
that it's past time for the Democratic Party to put waters out to pasture. Facebook has greatly reduced the distribution of our stories in our readers' news feeds and is instead promoting mainstream media sources. When you share on social media, however, you greatly help distribute our content. Please take a moment and consider sharing this article with your friends and family.